Hello people, what up? Today's message is about my story from about one month ago till now. I've been through a spiritual crisis and things have been a bit rough for me. I, I wasn't really sure what to do. I was scared to do something, but I felt like I had to do it, but I guess it's all about my free will, it's, about all, it's all about my freedom. All I wanted was to express myself as the full potential Seba, as the full me, as the complete me. Uh, things were blocking me, I was really going through a spiritual crisis. I guess I am still going through it. It's easier now, it's a bit easier now because I feel that I am recovering into freedom and I realized that it's all about myself, so I've, I've got choices to make, right? It, it all depends on what do I want to focus on. Okay, so I realized that I am actually in control of my thoughts and my emotions and that really life is happening for me, so whatever I choose that is based on love. But I guess that finding peace within myself is also related to finding peace in the world right uh, it's about the this spiritual crisis was about a past life uh, a, a life where I really fought for love and I felt like it was coming back to myself and it was really hard to accept it it still is hard to accept it but Again, it's about my freedom, so I realized that I will go there, I'll go there at the end, I will be free in the end, and I'm already there actually, I'm already free, and I have to realize that some hard moments really build you and make you stronger. These hard moments are there for us in order for us to realize that we can move really into a stronger space of consciousness, into a, into a smoother place of consciousness. It's about finding our truth, right? And it's about to stop lying to it's all it's all about stop lying to ourselves and realize who we really are. At the same time, if you find it hard to accept yourself, realize that love is all actually all there is. And if you really find hard to accept yourself, this may be a bit paradoxical, but try to give yourself uh, unconditional love. Because uh, your life is all about yourself, you have choices to make. And the more you suffer, I guess, the stronger you will get. Because life is not easy at times. Life really isn't easy at times and we are really guided by the Divine Realm. We are really guided by the Divine Realm, we are really love expressed into humans. And it's all about questioning ourselves, I guess. Questioning ourselves. What do we really want? Who do we really want to be? How do we really want to express ourselves? After my, my uh, traumatic past, I have dealt with some self-control issues again. And that came back from my past. And I, had real, I have realized that I have actually resisted it. It may have been a good thing, it may have been a bad thing, I don't know, but I guess I have the choices, I have the choice to choose, right? And sometimes there are dark moments, that is okay for us to experience, because the darkness and the light will become one the moment that you accept both. And I believe that your soul, pur your soul purpose will actually lead you exactly where you need to be. So right now you are exactly on your sole purpose and finding yourself into self-development and reading things and moving into higher consciousness is always beneficial for yourself to actually grow and expand. Okay, so I just felt like doing this video. I haven't done videos in maybe one week or I did a video but it passed a long time and I really missed it and sometimes yes i'm still scared i have i still have some belief systems that maybe serve me maybe they don't serve me 
and I am also finding myself moving into the fifth dimensional consciousness which is all about love, kindness, I guess, accepting everybody, realizing that everybody is a reflection of yourself, realizing that you are exactly, nothing is separated and you are the world. And I feel like moving also into my human self, combining spirituality with, with the human self, because we are all spiritual beings having human experience. And I don't know, I, I think I need to stay a bit more grounded to quit smoking, maybe cigarettes. That is a bit a bad habit of mine. I have also started reading more. I have also started moving into my body, doing some sports. I have been traveling a lot lately. Uh, everything is fun. Everything is fun at some level, but I have to realize that the outer world is only a reflection of the inner world. So I guess I must shift the inner world first. Uh, I guess that the only enemy is actually within myself. There is no enemy on the outside. Because if there is no enemy on the inside, the enemy on the outside has no power. Okay? So yeah, I guess this is it. This is today's video. The message is that I have been through a spiritual crisis. I, f I felt like I wasn't myself. Uh, you could send me some positive vibes, I accept it. And um, yeah, I also feel like I'm moving closer to my higher self. Um, I feel that I have to accept both these dualistic thoughts between good or bad. I feel that I gotta accept these dualistic thoughts. Okay, uh, I feel that I am also loved from the spiritual realm. I feel your love guys and I feel that the world is expanding a lot lately. So this month may have been rough for many of us, but I feel that there is great rewards at the end. Okay, thank you for watching and yeah, I just felt like I had to do this video to express myself and really open myself up to all kind of possibilities because anything is possible. I, I think I have to end the war that is within myself and the, the struggle that is within myself, the struggle that I had with other people, the struggle that I have created maybe. Okay, so it's all based on love, on higher frequencies, and compassion, I guess, and empathy. Thank you guys for watching, and see you on the next videos. I will be gone tomorrow. I'm going, I'm going with some friends on a trip. Stay peaceful, stay abundant, and thank you for watching, really. Ciao.